Hi traders, welcome to Daily Forex Analysis by Trade with Asim and Sichar. We are analyzing market for uh, Friday 26th of October. Tomorrow we have only two high impact news events. Uh, the first one is at 12.30 GMT for US dollar GDP. The forecast is weaker and we can ex expect a drop in US dollar at these times. Then later at 14 GMT we have uh, ECB President Draghi's speech. Uh, it can bring some volatility in the market. Uh, we can hear some key decisions and steps towards European economy and currencies. So good luck guys. Uh, let's move to dollar index. US dollar index was in full swing today. Currently a very strong bullish momentum is building up. Tomorrow I'm targeting 96.98. At this level it will form a double top and it may go for a slighter correction from this level. It's better to buy on dips. If dollar index closes above 97.00, so in next week we can expect further upward movement towards 98.00 and above. Today we were expecting Euro USD will go for a bigger correction. We were having a very strong economic data but it couldn't help Euro to rise again. Currently it's very weak against US dollar. It has broken a key support level and it's heading towards 1.1301 1 and much below. GBP USD was flat and a drop against US dollar. We didn't see any resistance. Currently it's on a minor support level at a daily time frame but it is supposed to drop further to 1.2728 and below. Canadian dollar lost all its gains against US dollar. For tomorrow I'm neutral on USD cat pair. If the US dollar keeps going higher, then we can expect USD cat pair to go and retest 1.3134 and above. While on the other hand, if it keeps dropping, then we can see 1.2969 again. Today, gold opened with a bullish impulsive move, but soon it started getting weaker against US dollar. It did struggle and found some support at 1231 but drop again to 1228 currently it's looking to rally again to 1238 level break above this level will result in bullish trend while closing below current level will open a gate for 1220 and below this morning nasdaq 100 bounced back from 6765 and went up all the way to 7050 but after a quick drop uh, it lost all its gains just in two hours Right now it may reach its previous low again, on the other hand it can also get some strength and may try to break above 7100. So guys that's all about today's video, I'll see you again, until then take care and bye.